The banksters can run, but they can't hide. Baron David D. Rothschild last week was formally indicted by the French government after he was accused of fraud in a scheme that allegedly embezzled large sums of money from British pensioners. Now, it's taken years to bring this case against him just to get this indictment. For him and his company, Financial Services Group, trapped hundreds of pensioners in a bogus loan scheme between the years of 2005 and 2008. Now, this Paris-based liaison judge, Javier Gomez Bermudez, ruled that the Rothschild must face a trial for his crimes and ordered the local police to seek him out at his various mansions that are spread throughout the country. We need to start seeing more of this. We've seen this in Iceland. I've reported on this recently. Now we're seeing it in France. It's time to bring it home here in America because we know that these banksters sit on top of these corporate governments. The courts state that they now are in agreement. They have enough evidence to interrogate Baron Rothschild. The next step, finding him. For those of you that are not aware, the Rothschild banking dynasty is a family line that's been around for a long time, and they've been accused of pulling political strings of many different gov governments through their control of various economic systems throughout the world. The Rothschilds have a long criminal history of insider trading, for example, going all the way back to the Napoleonic Wars. When British, when Britain won the war, Nathan Rothschild was one of the first to know, and he immediately went to the stock exchange and started selling stocks while putting out the rumor that the French had won the war. This created a panic on the floor. Uh, all the investors freaked out and started selling their stocks. Well then, as those stocks dropped, the Rothschilds came in and bought up everything at a fraction of the cost. And then when the word came in that the English actually had won the war, uh, that caused the stock market to soar overnight, and the Rothschild family uh, expanded their wealth and power tremendously and still remain one of the richest families in the world and one of the most corrupt, in my opinion. It's time to start jailing these criminal bankers, hold them accountable, get them out of there. Uh, any kind of judges or lawyers that are willing to put their neck out there to go after these guys, they need to be protected. And we as the public must hold everyone accountable and show these lawyers and judges and governments that we have their back and we demand justice.